What's up everyone and welcome to another episode here on NRV Outdoors. Today we're back in one of our favorite little creeks through a little bit of trout fishing. This week is very special. This is the following week after one of the biggest events in this little creek that we see all year long. Now pretty much what that means is two things. There's going to be a lot of fish in here, but they're all going to be really stubborn. These fish have been pressured extremely hard for the last week straight, and they have seen every bait imaginable. Now, if you just noticed during the beginning there, there was a couple jumping out there in the distance, and that's going to play perfectly into today's video, guys, because I have a bait today that I think is going to be perfect for these situations. It's going to look extremely natural and trick these finicky fish into feeding, and they're not even going to know they're hooked. And that is the Nico Dappy Stoneflies. In this little package, we have got some of the Nico Stoneflies. And this time of year, guys, as you know, nationwide, bugs are hatching like crazy. All kinds of active stuff is going on in the waterways, and these fish are keying in on it. So I'm reaching here and grab one of these little bugs out for you guys to look at here. Alrighty. Now, as you can see here, guys, it's just a very small little stonefly replica. It's brown, and it's got some little gold flecks. And because of those gold flecks, we're going to be rigging it up on our one 200th ounce mini trout magnet hook. This should work just perfectly, guys, for this little bitty bait. Now all we're going to do is flip it over, start at the head, and work our way down its body. This is the Nico material. It's very durable, very stretchy. So just work your hook on in, poke him on up there, just like that. And that's a perfect presentation for these stock trout that have been pressured all week long. And once again, these are Nico products. They're extremely durable and stretchy, and they're scented. Let's not waste any time, guys. Let's go ahead and hop into the creek. Our goal for today is just to catch a limit, maybe more, of these really stubborn trout. So let's get in here and let's see how long this will take. Alrighty guys, let's go on ahead and drop in cast number one. That little bug is going to fall super, super slow. So you want to cast well ahead of your target. We may even add a weight later on to help it get down there to the strike zone faster. We want a nice natural float guys. Just let that little thing just drift its way right on down. Looking as natural as possible. A couple twitches here and there is all we're going to implement for action. And just let it, let it drift guys. Oh, there was our first bite of the day on the very first cast. Not bad. Alrighty, guys, couple casts in. We've got a bit of wind picking up, so I'm thinking we're going to have to add ourselves just a tiny little split shot weight onto our rig here. It's going to take away from our natural look. If you guys notice on the hole here, guys, the wind is just blowing perfectly down the stream. And it's moving our bait a little too fast to be able to get down there where we need it. So what I'm thinking we're going to do is just pinch us on a little split shot several inches above our bait here guys i'd say eight to ten inches away just to give it a little bit of a, a chance to get down there before the wind grabs a hold of it. no way guys i was literally walking across the creek and this little beauty right here absolutely crushed it for us i was just making my way back trying to pick out a bit of a wind knot i created and this little brookie came right on over and grabbed our little Nico stonefly, no problem. Heck yeah, guys. I was just about to give up hope on this little hole as I thought they were pretty much fished out. And wouldn't you know it, there was one little bitty one waiting for us down here at the end of this run. What a gorgeous brookie too. We'll let her go on back strong. Check on her bait. It's in perfect condition as to be expected. Now I would be silly not to make a follow-up cast right through there. Didn't see any fish, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything as that little beauty right there absolutely wanted it, guys. Got him. <laughs> there we go, guys. Heck yeah. Right underneath this old rock. I knew there had to be one hiding up here in the shade. Heck yeah. Beautiful little rainbow trout. Took that old Nico stonefly, no problem. There we go. We got her in the net. Heck yeah, guys. Fish number two out of our starting hole of the day. And it's another nice one. Not super big, but right where she was supposed to be, guys. See if we can grab that old hook, give it an old pop out nice and easy. There we go. Gorgeous little rainbow trout there, guys. Let's just let her go on back strong, right back where she came from. 
Heck yeah, guys. Well, guys, just one little rainbow out from under this old rock. But like I mentioned in the beginning of this video, guys, this old creek right here has been hit extremely hard for seven days straight from daylight till dark. So all the fish we catch are likely going to be just like the last two guys hiding in very strange places and not where you would expect them to come from. So we'll keep fishing around, guys. I'm going to make a couple more casts over there in that hole. And then we're going to head to our next location. Alrighty guys, made our way down here to our second hole of the day. We're gonna fish around our little Nico stonefly, see if there's any trout left behind for us in this old run. This little run here is nice and deep and tends to hold them, so I feel pretty confident we might get one or two out of here. Don't think there'll be too much left behind though, if I'm being completely honest. Got him. Oh, he kicked it. I seen that booger come over and whop it too. Heck yeah, guys. Got him. There we go. Heck yeah, guys. Seen that little beauty over there? Took off the float and jigged it past her, and she absolutely crushed it too, guys. Big old nice, healthy brownie. Heck yeah, guys. And this will actually be our trifecta of the day. If we can get her in the net, let's just see here. Yep, there we go, guys. Heck yeah. Very first trifecta of the day on that Nico Stonefly. Gorgeous little brown trout here. Oh, calm down, we're gonna set you free, buddy. See if we can find that old hook. Give it a pinch, turn it loose, there we go. I mean, one gorgeous little speckled brown trout there, guys. Let's just let her go on back, happy and healthy. Heck yeah, guys, seen her out there. Jigged that old stone fly by her and she absolutely crushed it. Heck yeah. Got him. There we go, guys. Popped on that old float and managed to get ourselves another one. Heck yeah. These fish are super pressured, not wanting to bite. But we're just drifting that old bug by nice and slow. And they're coming over and getting it for us. This is our second rainbow of the day right here. Just a gorgeous little fish. Heck yeah, guys. We'll let her take on back strong while she's got the energy. Go ahead, take off get out of here there she goes heck yeah guys so it seems like just one fish here and there but we're getting them tricked we're getting them on that same little rig there guys let's just bomb it back in here that's four fish on the same little rig and we have not had any issues guys the bait's still in perfect shape still fishing just beautifully tricking these old fish into biting for us heck yeah guys heck yeah Got him. Same fish that just rolled, guys. Absolutely came over and crushed us. And it feels like a nice one, too. It feels like a nice one. Fantastic, guys. Wow, that fish is fighting so hard. Oh, it's because we got her hooked in the back. That's all right. Nope, she's got it in the mouth. We were just wrapped up on her fin there. That's what that was. She got wrapped up and got a little bit of leverage on us. She's got that old mini t-mag one two hundredth ounce right where you want it guys pop it right on out wow that fish is angry that's in there let's let this little beauty go on back strong all righty guys very last cast for this little run really impressed honestly with it we managed to get two rainbows out of here and a nice brownie and a little brookie as well not bad at all guys there's still a couple more in here that i've seen jumping around and 
showing off. But once again, guys, these fish are extremely, extremely conditioned to lures. They've been in here pressured for a solid week straight. And odds are, the ones we tricked are only because our bait looked so natural. They didn't expect anything of it, guys. But not too bad so far. I think our next stop will be the old deep hole that we make a lot of our videos in because that particular hole got stocked extremely, extremely well during the week. Although it did get a lot of anglers, a lot of those fish will put their bellies to the bottom and they'll just simply stop feeding until the pressure is relaxed off some. And today, guys, I haven't seen any anglers yet on the water. So I'm hopeful that when we get there, the fish have been left alone for the most part. We can manage to trick us one. So let's go ahead and reel up and let's head there now. All righty, guys, made our way right on down here to one of our favorite little holes. Like I was mentioning earlier, guys, this little hole right here got stocked like crazy all week long. This particular run got hit every single day. But the amount of anglers that was here was completely astronomical. I'm talking dozens, if not even hundreds, fish right here over the last week, guys. So we might really struggle to catch any fish out of here. And I'm not seeing very many left behind, but we'll fish it nice and slow, guys. We'll pick it apart. We'll let this little Nico stonefly do its work for us. And hopefully, just hopefully, we can slide in front of one of these old fish and get them to bite. There we go. Got him. Got him on. Heck yeah, guys. Seen that one over there? And it was, oh, it was acting super finicky. But she came over and just crushed that old stonefly for us, guys. It was a nice little brownie. We'll take it. Heck yeah. Got him. There we go. There we go. Little rainbow on. Absolutely crushed that old stonefly too. Gosh, I don't even see it down there. She absolutely smoked it. Wow. Should be able to get it out. No problem. Heck yeah, guys. That little rainbow absolutely choked on it. Heck yeah. Got him. Heck yeah, guys. Heck yeah. Big old nice rainbow. Absolutely crushed that old stonefly. Slide in the net. There we go. Heck yeah, guys. Heck yeah. These old fish have been biting really slow. Calm down. We're going to set you back in there. This one's super angry still super angry yes she is Do that old hookup oh there we go guys popped her off she had it good let's go ahead and let her slide on back well guys that's pretty much going to do it for today's little nico video that little stonefly caught us an absolute ton of fish, including a near double trifecta as we just missed that last little brownie and missed our opportunity there. But all in all, guys, a really epic day of fishing. Had a ton of fun out here using that old Nico stonefly, and they were absolutely crushing it, guys. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button down below and get out if you can, boys and girls, and do yourself some fishing and have some fun. But most importantly, be safe and tight lines.